All right, guys, here's a couple really uh, cool, easy drills I've been doing with students during lessons. And the uh, interesting is, thing is they're both done with one arm, okay? So first version here, right, you can do it. You can do it without the club first if you want, okay, is take your lead arm, put it underneath your trail, right, and work on coming back, halfway back, soft fold here, up to the top. You're going to feel this pinch in. You're not going to let this get way out here, you know, baseball style, flying elbow here. You're going to pinch this in. And then on the way down, shift and turn, right? You can see this pinch and stay in front here, right? Most golfers, when they come down, have it like this. They break it, hips are forward, okay? So you can do that with the club too, okay? You can just take the club, add it, right? Work on the same thing, get that same feel, okay? Then, right, secondly, okay, this is a good drill for all you people who kind of lose some lag, hit a lot of shots on the heel. Because of it, it's just take your lead arm again, go right through like just below the bicep here, okay, right through the elbow. Okay, and swing, you swing halfway back, keep that same feel. Okay, make sure face is in line with the spine. Back to the top, right? And then as we come down, right, we're gonna keep this bend here, right? Try to feel that into impact. Instead, we don't wanna let this straighten out, right? You're gonna hit shots way off the neck. Okay, so we keep the bend here, come down, check the face, right, and then just come right down into impact. You'll see this soft fold, and then post impact, you're getting that extension down the target line. Okay, most people get that too extended on the downswing, and as a consequence, you know, we'll have to pull the path across or hit shots off the heel, a lot of shanks that we don't want to deal with. So try this out. I think it's pretty helpful for anyone. Uh, catch you guys later.